because when the shuttle's gone, they can't bring up these big spare parts anymore. They also can't bring stuff down. Or down. So what's going to have to bring it down? Anything interesting? Yeah, some, you know, uh, like a temporary sleep station. Mm-hmm. which uh, Sandy had used, okay. and also a couple of experiments, samples. Right. Is that a darn Japanese yes. experiment? Oh, yeah, right. Japanese experiment. Yeah, rig my structure and play with retrieve during the EVAs. You find this useful? Yeah, it's good training. Yeah, it's yeah. good to be it's yeah. good training. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah get into Rookie, that. It's even. And this is your first flight. Yeah, my first flight. And so. you're a, you're a uh, Japanese mm-hmm. astronaut, yes. but you trained with all of us. Oh, yeah. Was that okay? Did it, you know, you run a lot of sure. Americans all the time. It was okay. It's fun. It's you feel like you're almost like an American now? Or? Yeah. You do, really? Five years now. Really? My daughter is, you know, considers herself as Texan. That's right, yeah. So how old is your daughter? Oh, she's seven years old. She's seven years old. This is your first flight in the so I know you're excited, oh, right? Yeah, you're very, yeah. very excited. <laughs> and old Japan is probably excited, too. Oh, well, yeah, I hope right? so, too, yeah. It's a big deal. So, yes. It's a big deal. Yeah. Well, you this is like number three. Is anyone even going to show up? What, uh, what's going on? Uh, I think my wife and happen? kids might show up. Yeah, are they going to come? They're not busy. They're gonna... <laughs> yeah, the third time you're not as anxious. You're uh, you know, it's your first mission. You want to hurry up and do it because you can't wait. Now your third yeah. mission is like, well, it'll happen. I'm not worried. Yeah. I know it'll happen eventually. So, but it's always fun. Uh, well, thanks for talking with us. I know you guys are still you're busy, aren't you? Yes, I'm waiting 10 minutes to check a number so that I can wait 20 more minutes. All right. All right. Well, thanks for, <laughs> thanks for talking with us. All right. Hey, thanks, Mike. All right. We'll see you guys see again. You. All right. Discovery Houston, Editor Ash, here for Rick. As a planetary scientist at the Johnson Space Center, John Gruner studies rocks and minerals here on Earth to better understand environments on other planets. Probably the best part about my job is getting out in the field, uh, going out to volcanoes, lava flows, mountains, uh, you know, even washed out canyons. Just getting out there, cracking on rocks, looking at how this planet was formed, trying to figure things out. That's just a lot of fun.